we're back with another get dressed with me this isn't two this is actually six but even if i it's still not two it's three it's giving um pirates of the caribbean caribbean whatever my little rat tail <laughs> Why can I not think and button at the same time? And I'm failing at both. Y'all are gonna be like, what in the heck are you thinking, girl? I got this belt from the Rail Rail, mostly because I'm cheap. Even though I like lubed my body from head to toe. Like, I don't need to be like trying to get out of the bubbles, you know? I just put mascara on and I sneeze afterwards and it's like the worst timing in the world. Thankfully, we didn't get the Transfer, you know? That would've been tragic. Tragic! All right! Hi! Welcome back to another Get Dressed With Me where I talk about random things and get dressed. Revolutionary, I know. So, I need to run a couple errands, and by a couple I mean two. This isn't two, this is actually six, but even if I, it's still not two, it's three. Okay, <laughs> Um, that's where we're at today. I have to run to the post office. I think I was supposed to run to the post office last time I filmed one of these, but it didn't happen. So I lied to you. Another thing I lied to you about in the last Get Dressed With Me is that I was going to be styling an older piece that I never wear in my wardrobe. And I lied again because I am back with a new piece. But I just got this the other day and I think it's really cute and I think I know how I want to style it, but it could be an utter and complete fail, so we're just winging it. Um, but yeah, I do need to go to the post office, and I do need to go to Amazon, because I need to be a good daughter and send my dad the package that I said I would best send. And then Amazon, I ended up buying a fake moisturizer. Sad, sad story. But anyhow, that's where we're at. We're going to style this little piece. It's like a, I got it from H&M when I was at the mall. I just saw it and grabbed it and I was like, when I saw it, I was like, yes, I'm a linen blouse girl. And then I was like, it's giving pirate, it's giving um, pirates of the Caribbean, Caribbean, whatever. But I think it could be dressed really cute. So let's, let's do it. Let's try. This obviously could be a workwear piece, like easy peasy. Oh no, did I just get makeup on it? No, we're good. Um, obviously workwear piece, super easy peasy, but I figured if you're like trying to dress it differently, we're gonna throw it on with some jeans and sneakers because that's what I do. But what was I gonna say? I would have sized down in this. I got this in a small, but it's quite large. And since I'm tucking into pants, I would have preferred to go with like an extra small, but I didn't see one. They do actually have other colors and prints of this as well, if, if white's not your deal. But yeah, let's try it. Let's see if we can uh, make it work. If not, it's going back. Um, I have normal makeup on as per usual. My hair is uh, dirty, so we're doing a slick back today. I mean, we're not keeping it in this. My little rat tail. <laughs> um, we're not keeping it in this, but we're going to do a bun because I need to wash my hair tomorrow. And we might also not fit in our pants today because I did the whole, you know before you get spray tanned and or do your own sunless tanner, the shower. Well, I did the bath, because I'm gonna do the shower tomorrow. But like, you know, where you like sh scrub every ounce of dead flaky skin off of you, shave every hair. I only do my legs, I don't do my arms. But you know what I mean, I did the shower. And then I was like, shoot. Now I have to get dressed. And we all know, me and lotion and pants do not go, but we're gonna make it work anyway. So I'm channeling a very springtime outfit in this, what I'm going, white jeans, the white top, the white sneaker. But yeah, it's like 20 degrees out. And I've been like, where's the snow, where's the snow? And now I'm like, ooh, spring. <laughs> make it make sense. So let's take the tag off of this guy and get dressed. These are like my favorite jeans ever. I actually had to get a new pair because they ripped. Um, and yeah, you betcha. I went back and was like, Abercrombie, this isn't happening. This is not the quality that I am expecting. So I got another pair. They gave me merch credit for my other one. So if you have a quality issue, don't just like chalk it up to a loss, especially if they're jeans that are expensive. So we got them on. 
looking cute. I never realized I was one of those girls that like, you know those certain, there's two people, type of people that go on vacation, right? There's those people, oh, this bra's like slightly, should have gotten with more of my skin tone, but anyway, you know there's those type of people, there's two type of people, well there's probably more than two type, but my brain can only think of two right now. So there's the people who, um, why can I not think and button at the same time? And I'm failing at both. There's the people that you know are going on vacation for like three months. Like the minute they book their vacation, they are talking about their vacation until they go. I never realized that, but I'm that type of person, which is why I typically wait till the last minute to book my vacation. Um, or there's the people that like you don't even know they're going on vacation and they're like, surprise, I'm in Mexico. I'm not that person. I should be that person, but I'm not that person. Okay, what do we think? I'm not gonna button it all the way up. Let me kind of do this thing. <laughs> it's giving major pirate. It's okay. Okay, so here we are. Nothing. This is this is giving nothing right now. But we're gonna style it. I'm gonna look in the mirror while I style it. Okay. <laughs> this guy is literally gonna be like, "You look like a pirate." I kind of do. It's kind of giving pirate. I feel like I could use a belt. Is this giving pirate? Y'all are gonna be like, what in the heck are you thinking, girl? I can already see the comments are rolling in. Let's see. Should I keep my hair down though? But my hair is so like, not only dirty, I just never styled it this week. So it's like kind of giving like crimpled bedhead, you know? Not the vibe I'm going for necessarily. <laughs> I have another shirt very similar to this um, that also gives, Scott calls it my pirate shirt, and I'm here for it. So, okay, I kind of, I feel like I have a hair stuck on me. I'm like, ugh, feel like I'm kind of choking and I'm getting makeup everywhere, but we're just gonna go with it. Okay, I wouldn't, I think I would wear my hair down. But then again, I was thinking with the neckline the way it is, like you should wear your hair up. So, let's see. Let's see. Sure. My hair's like not quite long enough to do a bun, but it's also too long to do like a cute little bun. That makes no sense, Kelly. It's, it's interesting. Should a belt? I feel like it's the bra that's really throwing me off, but like I just don't care enough to like change it because it's like it's, it's a shocker I wear a bra all right um let's do some jewelry take off the apple watch because the apple watch really wasn't giving what it needed to give should I use a belt should I, would a belt work I got this belt from the real real mostly because I'm cheap <laughs> and also because um yeah mostly just because I'm cheap <laughs> I buy 90% of my like luxury, I don't buy much luxury, but if I do, it's always like secondhand. Not always, most of the time. Um, this is the most amount of money I've like ever spent on belt though. Okay, that's kind of cute. What do we think? What do we think? This is giving enough to like, be kind of more casual. Now let's put on sneakers and really cash it up and then we'll go in with the jewelry because I have the gold, so we've got some gold jewelry to go with it. How proud we are that I fit in these jeans today even though, even though I like lubed my body from head to toe or my socks. I don't know if you can see my like Lush bag. I also did a Lush bath. When's the last time you've been to Lush? I feel like Lush really had its like pop off era back when like, um, back when like, what was that noise? Back when like beauty influencers were like really in their prime, like circa 2010 maybe, 2011. I did meet a fair share of Lush hauls. They're just so expensive now. I'm sure they were expensive back then, but I felt like they were five bucks, which like, can you justify $5 for a bath? Mm, maybe, 
But like now they're like ten dollars, which is why my self every time, every time, every time. Um, which is why I like cut them in half, and I'm still like I'm only spending five dollars on a bubble bath. <laughs> Cheap, don't care. But you also don't need that much bubbles. Like I don't need to be like trying to get out of the bubbles, you know. So. I just washed these and they're always like tight when I first wash them because they were looking a little grimy. I am feeling like Captain Morgan. <laughs> oh, the commentary. What are we thinking? Are we, is it coming together? I think it's cute. Let's put on our finishing touches, some jewelers and some fragrance. It's cute. These jeans, the best thing about these jeans is the pockets. Like, it just makes you look like you have a booty because of the way the pockets are like, floop, you know? Floop. The other day when I was at the mall with Scott, and Scott's like, always begs to go into the Rolex store because he has a Rolex, and I'm just like, you are too bougie for my blood. Also, pay zero attention to my nails because I did not paint them. I'm painting them tomorrow. Um, well, I painted them. They're like chipping off. But anyway, he always asks me to like go in the Rolex store and I'm always just like, dude, I don't go in there because like they know I'm poor. Like they can just smell it on me. They can smell that I'm just not wealthy enough to want to wear a Rolex. Um, and so I'm just like, no, I'm good. And he's like, just go look at what watch you want to get. And I'm just like, I would love a Rolex. Like really love one. But like I also just... don't care that much. I mean, I wish I could. I really like the green faced ones, which is where I'm kind of like leaning towards, but I, I mean not leaning towards the Rolex. Let's do some more lip mask. I've been riding with this guy, this Fenty Beauty Plush Puddin. It's just like a milky pink lip gloss or lip balm lip mask but it like really stays like okay so let's go in with a frog rongs. I don't know which one I'm feeling I'm kind of feeling something different like what I never wear I believe this is the um why is that mmm that one's really nice okay I'm gonna go with this one but I was gonna go with this one but we're going this. This is Floral Violet by Dossier. I don't know what the... I think it's not a Chloe, but a... Daisy? Thinking that this is not the move, I tell you that much. I think it's cute. I think it's like... I don't know. I like it. I'm here for it. So look, I should slick back my hair, but honestly, it's like greasy and textured enough from the dry shampoo I don't need to. Um, makeup. Oh, my earrings are Ana Luisa. Love these little, they look like croissant rolls. Now I want a croissant. Um, watch MVMT and then my bracelets. I'll link these are from Amazon. Nails chipped and not polished correctly. I honestly would wear instead of these shoes, hold on, are my new ones. And um, don't mind the fact that they're stuffed with socks. They're packed in my suitcase. Um, Scott bought me these for Christmas. These are like my favorite splurge worthy sneakers of all time. The Axel Arigato sneakers. Um, I just got these in the correct size. You need to like size up with these in my opinion because the toe box is skinnier than the clean 90s. Anyway. Um, I would wear these with it because I think they're a bit more classic versus the Converse, but I'm not wearing these out in this, the, the salt. Mm -mm, no girl. So these are the choice that I would make minus the sack stuffing. Um, but yeah, this is what I would choose if I was like not going outside in the gross. I mean, I would wear these outside. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Okay, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed another get dressed with me video. I love these. I just think they're a really fun way to just connect and share a different 
side of me and kind of a little bit more of my like true personality. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go to the post office and then tonight I'm going to probably change out of this because I'm going to be making like an orange chicken for dinner with some broccoli and some rice because we need to use up some leftovers before we leave out of town. Because if you didn't know, I'm going on vacation. <laughs> I'm that girl. Um, so if you want to see that, check out my vlog channel. I think it'll be up by then. So yeah, I love you guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.